we are at Guastafino's event space in New York City below the 59th Street Bridge for the ninth annual Call Honor Awards. We will be meeting some of the attendees as they arrive. Look who I found. I found the host for the evening, Angela and Tony DiTrelisi. You look wonderful. Who are you wearing, Angela? Stop staring. Uh, stop staring? Uh, my eyes are up here. <laughs> <laughs> That's the name of the, of the brand, Stop Staring. Oh, well, you look you look wonderful. And Tony, I hear there's a story about your suit. Yes, my suit is safe back in Massachusetts where I left it. But this backup suit is courtesy of Men's Warehouse. I'm going to look good. That's all I can think of is that guy. You're going to look good. I guarantee it. <laughs> and he was right. He was right. You look great. Any surprises in store tonight? Absolutely. Yes. I would say there are a few. We have yes. a, little, a few tricks up our sleeves. A couple of little surprises. Yeah, just for you. Well, terrific. Well, enjoy the uh, evening. Thank you. I found Francois Mouly. She's the recipient tonight of the uh, Bridge Award and the, one of the founders of Toon Books. Tell us about Toon Books. Uh, Toon Books is trying to bring comics to kids. And it's easy because kids love it. But then you also have to do the bridging part of trying to get the parents, the educators, uh, librarians to accept comics as a legitimate medium. So it's wonderful to get an award that legitimizes the medium I love. I am honored to be here with Jerry Pinkney. You know, he is tonight's recipient of the uh, Call Honor for Artists. And I know that there's an art auction going on downstairs. And it is the artwork for from a cover for School Library Journal, a magazine I know very well. Tell us a little bit about that cover. Well, you know, it, the um, that issue, that particular issue, celebrates the Caldecott uh, Medal winner, and I wanted to do something that was about the lion actually and the mouse celebrating. So the image came out of uh, the idea of of. of, of of a star, you know, and um, the, the playfulness. But the I really I wanted to say that not only am I excited about the idea of getting the Caldecott Medal, uh, but the the central characters are also excited. So, what does the uh, the uh, Call Honor mean to you? Well, I have a history with the Call Honor. I was on the board, and I was actually at the groundbreaking. So I'm very close to it. So. You know, you're being honored by family, and there's something pretty special about this. So it's a kind of a, a shared honor in many ways for me. I'm with Dr. Perry Class. She's the National Medical Director for the Reach Out and Read organization, and they're receiving the Angel Award here at the uh, Call Honors. Doctor, tell us how you became involved with the organization. From the first time I heard about it, when it was just one program in one hospital where I happened to work, it seemed like such a great idea to be incorporating picture books and advice about reading aloud into the checkups and the well child visits. We're now in more than 5,000 clinics and hospitals and medical centers, and we are giving those books and that advice to more than four million children all around the United States. Well, a well-deserved honor. Well, you enjoy the uh, evening. You know, if there is a kid-lit party in New York City, you can find two people there. Myself and Mr. Cheska. John Cheska is here with us. And Wait, this is a children's book party? I didn't know that. <laughs> What did you think it was, John? I can't tell you, but it's under a bridge. Uh, th this is true. This is true. Well, you have a new book out, and I hear it's doing pretty well. Tell me about it. Uh, it's about a kid named Frank Einstein. He's a genius. So he can make anything, and he explains all of science in six books with two robots and a chimpanzee. Well, I'm sure everybody <laughs> out there, you, you know John, so you have to pick this book up. And, and you made a guest appearance on a book trailer playing Cheese. Uh, what book? Do you, it was Paul Zielinski's, right? Oh my God, I didn't know anyone was going to know about that. Uh, well, you're listed in the credits, <laughs> so it's very appropriate that you're Cheese. Yes. Hey John, this is the red carpet, so who are you wearing? Um... Take <laughs> <laughs> a look. <laughs> uh, something of my own creation. I don't know if you know that, but I made this coat, I made these shoes, I made my underwear. A, a, a John of all trades. Yes. Yeah.